And so the, the software, the operating system for these AI factories is insanely complicated. Well, one of the observations, and this is, this is a, a really terrific, terrific thing about having a homogeneous architecture like NVLink 72, is that every single GPU could do all the things that I just described. And we observe that these reasoning models are doing a couple of phases of computing. One of the phases of computing is thinking. When you're thinking, you're not producing a lot of tokens. You're producing tokens that you're maybe consuming yourself. You're thinking. Maybe you're reading. You're digesting information. That information could be a PDF. That information could be a website. You could literally be watching a video, ingesting all of that at super linear rates. And you take all of that information and you then formulate the answer, formulate a plan to answer. And so that digestion of information, context processing, is very flops intensive. On the other hand, during the next phase is called decode. So the first part we call prefill. The next phase of decode requires floating point operation, but it requires an enormous amount of bandwidth. And it's fairly easy to calculate.